introducing the 2024-2 Schrodinger release. In this video, we'll briefly cover various new features and improvements to the Maestro user interface and updates to the application panels. In Maestro, one can now seamlessly copy fragments from existing molecules and paste them onto selected atoms in another molecule. Simply select and copy the atoms and use the paste special as added fragments on potential attachment atoms. This feature streamlines molecular editing tasks such as interactively copy and pasting R groups between ligands. Down in the status bar, we see the dynamic display of measurements based on selected atoms. With two selected atoms, we see the distance measurement automatically appear. With three connected atoms selected, it displays the angle. And with four, we see the dihedral. Double clicking the text will then add them to the measurements table. In the entry list, enhanced searching capabilities is now possible with regular expressions, enabling precise and simultaneous searches for multiple entries. In the workspace, the fonts for Pharmacophore labels can now be controlled via the Maestro font preferences. In the trajectory viewer, one can export movies while maintaining the resolution of the workspace. In the scatter plots, there is now automatic synchronization between data point selection and project table selections and or workspace inclusion. And with the new multiple entry set option, one can easily display data from different project table groups in a single scatter plot. Moving on to the application panels, the 2024-2 release unveils the FEP protocol builder, a powerful new workflow designed to streamline the process of identifying FEP plus model parameters using advanced machine learning techniques, ideal for situations where the default FEP plus protocol may be suboptimal. With the FEP protocol builder, users can now explore a wide range of FEP plus parameters, including map settings like map topology, reference ligand set, and custom cores. Experiment with various calculation parameters, such as water models, GCMC water sampling, and lambda schemes. Structural options for both ligand and receptors are also customizable, allowing for the determination of rest residues, histidine states, and testing glutamine and asparagine flips. Moreover, the protocol builder settings can be fine-tuned, such as to automate ligand assignments to training and test sets. Upon completion, the FEP protocol builder results viewer will then provide a comprehensive overview of the trialed FEP protocols, displaying the top-ranked protocols for easy validation. Simply click on a protocol to view the optimized set of parameters used, correlation plots, and review outputs directly in the FEP Plus panel, where, now thanks to the FEP Protocol Builder, users can proceed with greater confidence in running FEP Plus jobs prospectively within their programs. And speaking of FEP Plus, we see new support for setting up positional restraints in relative binding FEP, as well as the ability to use the new OPLS5 force field, which can significantly boost accuracy in relative binding FEP, achieved through the addition of explicit polarization to improve model accuracy for polarizable atoms, molecular ions, and cation pi interactions. Improved support for RNA receptors is seen throughout the suite, in sitemap, we see more accurate identification of RNA binding sites, with 89% of RNA sites in the Haribos set now identified as the top-ranking binding site, up from 69% previously. While in Glide ligand docking, there is a new option that allows for improved pose prediction and virtual screening enrichment when docking small molecules into RNA receptors. In the constant pH simulation panel, Users can now select lysine as one of the supported titratable residues. In the ligand designer, a new workflow is available for systematically swapping ring systems within a compound's core structure. Here, one can easily select the desired ring system, choose from a range of rings if needed, and then click enumerate. The resulting ideas will be generated, docked, and seamlessly integrated into Maestro.
Lastly, the non-standard residue panel introduces the enamine collection, offering 430 novel non-natural amino acids, ideal for peptide design. As always, for a comprehensive overview of the latest features in the 2024-2 Schrodinger release, please visit schrodinger.com forward slash new features.